so my last video did pretty well it got um a copyright strike for the 13 seconds i played of a SZA song i don't even think it was 13 seconds i think it was like I, oh my god i think it was like seven seconds but <laughs> it's whatever i look like a baboon i look like I look like a caveman, like, I look like, um, a prehistoric creature with how my hair is right now. I'm sorry, I apologize. On, like, one note, it looks pretty at some angles, but this angle? No. Um, okay, but I do want to talk about my YouTube video being taken down and, like, me getting a strike on my channel. That was not cool. So, long story short... I had a 19 minute video up um, that kind of like was just a compilation of videos I made while I was psychotic and manic. I know, I know, that's pretty edgy, okay? And I really don't care if the video gets put up again. I really don't. I just don't like the strike on my- oh, hi. Hi. I love you. Hi. Sorry, I love her. She stinks though. She stinks like shit. What was I gonna say? Yeah, no, uh... I don't really care if the video is put up again. I think it kind of sucks that I don't I don't have the video at all other than, you know, uh in YouTube. I do this thing where after I completely edit a video and it's done and I post it on YouTube, I delete it, I delete all the footage and um yeah. So I still probably have all the footage from that video since it was a compilation and i th those videos took like a long time to find um in my camera roll because my camera roll has a lot of shit in it but but the video itself is gone everywhere which is great um it's not actually great i'm kind of sad about that but again it's a edgy video um some like emotional shit happened in the video Let's get into why it was taken down, though. It was taken down for violating YouTube's child safety policy. Now, let me just say, I read through this child safety policy, like, five to ten times. I wanted to really make sure that, um, that they knew what they were taking down my video for. Uh, and I, the only reason I can see my video getting taken down for would be potentially being distressing towards minors who watch my video but at the end of the day minors should not be watching my video because it was not made for kids i always mark my videos not made for kids and if i don't well it should be pretty um self-explanatory that it's not made for children um all the videos that i have marked have always been marked not made for kids. I've never made content for children. I think that's pretty obvious. I cuss on my videos. I talk about sex and I talk about furries and I talk about um, fucking people breaking the law in the last video. Like, this is all in the last video. So, like, I, I really don't understand that. And if there are children watching my video or videos... Um, well, I think it's pretty obvious they shouldn't be. Um, that's, that's not a me issue. It's not my fault children are watching my videos. It's YouTube's fault. Because they don't have a good system for checking age. And I'm not gonna bring up anything for that. I don't care. I am under 18. I, I am like, I, I turned 18 in like six months. So I'm still, you know, I'm still 17. But I really don't appreciate YouTube take, taking down my video for a reason that seems very invalid. There should not be children watching my video and it should not be distressing minors because guess what? There shouldn't be minors watching my video. It's made for pe a, 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 a mature audience, a, a mature audience who knows what's happening. And you can debate whether, um, whether or not it's okay or not for me, a minor to be making content for mature audiences. That's fine, but at the end of the day, there's nothing in YouTube's child safety policy that says anything about that. Uh, I really don't appreciate that. The other reasons that my video could have been taken down for is using vaporizers or drugs, which there were no drugs or vaporizers being used in the video at all. There were also absolutely no dangerous acts being performed. The only dangerous thing I can imagine would have been me biking at night 
yes, I go on bike rides at night sometimes, and I had a video of that. whoop de fucking do I'm not getting hit by a car in the video. I'm not jumping off of ledges in the video. I'm not doing anything crazy. I'm just acting crazy, and that's it. So I think that's kind of bullshit, but it's whatever. Um, at the end of the day, it's like, what can I do? What, what, what can I do? I reached out to YouTube on Twitter, which I really didn't have to do because I try to, I try to keep my Twitter, like, career-focused, kinda. I make a lot of weird, dumb, shitty jokes on there. But other than that, I don't, I don't use Twitter at all. And I have people who I work with on there, uh, who I'm mutuals with, and it really sucks for them to see YouTube fucking me over. It's really embarrassing, honestly. I tried, and nothing came of it. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention in the video while I was recording that I did make an appeal. As you can see here, I did try to make an appeal, and it just went to shit. It didn't work, so... So I really, I, I just don't appreciate this treatment from YouTube. I got a strike on my channel. I got a copyright strike for the last video. Great. YouTube does not like its small creators. There are countless times of YouTube not being a good platform with this type of shit. And I, I, I just, I just don't get it. I don't, I don't get how you, how you make a video hosting website, a website where anybody could post whatever they want but they can't. It's not even that, actually. You know what? You shouldn't be able to post whatever you want. If you want to post, like, fucking porn or gore on YouTube, then fuck you. You should get your shit taken down. But I didn't do that. I just posted videos of me in a bad state of mind. That's it. And I'm always in a bad state of mind in all of my videos. So I don't really kind of, I really don't get why, I just really don't, I just don't understand it. Also, my video was up for, like, months. At least four months. I'd say like four to seven months um, it was up. I, f I know I finished the video in October. I just don't know when I posted it. Like October last year. So, I don't know. It's just really fucking weird. You know what I mean? But other than that, I don't really have much else to talk about. I'm really, I'm really thankful that my last video got kind of big despite the copyright strike. I don't really know what that does. I don't make any money from my YouTube videos and I'm probably not going to when I am eligible for uh, monetization because, you know, let's let's be real. YouTube already don't like me. They gave me a strike on my channel and they gave me a copyright strike for no goddamn reason. So at the end of the day, it's just like, I'm fucked. It's not like I'm posting enough to have a career on here anyway. I don't know, but I still really appreciate the love I got in the last video. I really appreciate the comments. I love interacting interacting with the people who like my stuff. I got a lot of new subs from that video and I really appreciate it. And although it's not getting as many views as it was, it is still one of the highest viewed videos on my channel. And I think it's, it's a good video and I'm glad people liked it. Um, so that's pretty cool. But yeah, uh, that's all I really had to talk about today. I don't really have anything interesting to talk about. I've been wanting to make another YouTube video, but I just didn't really know what to say. Um, but hopefully this is good enough. Hopefully y'all like my shit. Uh, and yeah, I hope you have a great day. <laughs> okay, goodbye. I love you.